Planet Dolan. From expensive and embarrassing misprints to causing a spacecraft disaster, we count 10 typos that had shocking consequences. Number 10. Bible promotes promiscuity. To err is human, but apparently not even the Heavenly Father is above the odd inattention to detail. In 1631, London's Baker Book House published what came to be known as the Wicked Bible. Somehow, they allowed a mistake to slip through in the Ten Commandments. The missing word accidentally resulted in the command, Thou shalt commit adultery. Parliament was furious and ordered that all Bible copies with errors be immediately destroyed. The London publisher was also fined £3,000. Very unchristian. Number 9. Seller short changes himself. A typo in an eBay listing left a red-faced seller significantly short-changed. The listing was for a 150-year-old bottle of Alsop's Arctic Ale, which was worth a small fortune to vintage collectors. However, the seller misspelled the brand name, resulting in next to no ad traffic. Since no collectors knew the bottle was for sale, an eagle-eyed shopper who chanced upon the rare booze was able to purchase it for a paltry $304. Using correct spelling, the lucky buyer promptly resold it for a tidy $503,300. Number 8. Brave New Word English is a hodgepodge language made up of words from all over. Although grammar junkies believe it's sacred, the language actually has some words which are neither based in Greek or Latin. They're freaking typos. Dord is one such word. It first appeared in the Webster's Third New International Dictionary in 1931 as a physics and chemistry noun meaning density. It was then used freely until 1939 when an editor discovered the word lacked an origin story or an etymology. After the grammar police broke down the door to investigate, it was revealed that Dord was originally submitted by a Webster's chemistry editor and was supposed to read capital D or lowercase d which was the abbreviated form of density. But the letters were printed too closely together, and a new word was born. Number 7. Car Dealership Promotional Error In 2007, a Roswell car dealership conceived a brilliant promotion to increase sales. They sent out 50,000 scratch tickets, one of which would reveal a $1,000 cash prize. Unfortunately, the Atlanta-based marketing company behind the production mistakenly printed every one of the 50,000 scratch tickets as a grand prize winner. This brought the dealership's grand payout to $50 million, which would have made even Oprah look like a stingy gift giver. Unable to honor the debt, the dealership offered ticket holders a $5 Walmart consolation certificate, which cost them $250,000. Definitely an expensive blunder. Number 6. NYC Ticket Price Blunder In 2013, New York City's Transportation Authority had to recall 160,000 maps and posters announcing a price hike for paper-ride travel cards. The price was rising from $4.50 to $5, but a typographical error listed the new price as $4.50, so the information was recalled, most likely at commuter's expense. I suppose we should be grateful the new price wasn't $450, which is probably what a train ride will cost in 10 years. Number 5. Shares for a Steal In December 2005, a trader on the Tokyo Stock Exchange made what's known in the business world as Code 11. That is, he completely fucked up. Obviously, the trader had his pants on backwards that day because he intended to trade one share at 610,000 yen but instead placed an order for 610,000 shares at 1 yen each. No amount of pleading to the Tokyo Stock Exchange could reverse the error, and the firm's loss was around 18.7 million in damages. Christmas bonus forfeited. Number 4. Money misprint. Coin misprints have happened at mints all over the world, like the modified coin husks on Wisconsin State's quarter. Certainly, no coin errors have been as shocking as the one that occurred at the Chilean Mint. Engraver Pedro Uzura Lisiana made an error in late 2008 that was overlooked by all his superiors. Under the approval of multiple employees, the Chilean Mint printed coins that misspelt the name of their own country. The coins, which read Chi, somehow went unnoticed until 10 months later. 
By that point, they were widely circulated and the Chilean government couldn't do anything about it. The general manager and responsible staff were sacked for the humiliating oversight, and the coins went on to become huge collector's items. Number three, racist pasta. The Australian arm of juggernaut publisher Penguin made an unfortunate blunder in the 2010 publication of the Pasta Bible. Instead of pepper, the recipe recommended seasoning the dish with salt and freshly ground black people. Honest mistake. I mean, I'm always asking for sex with my coffee when I mean sugar. It's just lucky we all wear handprints well. No recall was made of the books already being circulated, but the printer quickly destroyed all 7,000 remaining copies in its inventory. It's lucky the error wasn't preserved using the powers of the interweb. Number 2. Nassau's Missing Hyphen Hyphens, or dashes, aren't usually considered important punctuation, but the absence of one from a line of coding spelt disaster for Nassau in 1962. The missing hyphen caused the failure of Mariner 1, America's first interplanetary probe. Given America's determination to win the space race, it's possible the dash was a communist bent on sabotaging the mission. The missing hyphen was needed to correctly set the craft's trajectory. Without it, the craft exploded minutes after takeoff. 2001 A Space Odyssey novelist Arthur C. Clarke called it the most expensive hyphen in history. Number 1 X-Rated Vacation Back in the prehistoric days of phone books, California-based travel agency Banner Travel Services printed an unforgettable ad in the Yellow Pages. Their ad boasted of the company's forte in erotic destinations. Obviously, they'd meant to write exotic, but the typo certainly piqued the interest in an entirely new demographic. Perverts. The printer that approved the mistake offered to waive its usual $230 monthly listing fee, but Banner Travel Services went 10 steps further and sued for $10 million. Stay in school, kids. Come check out Super Planet Dolan. Danger Dolan and I will answer your life questions. To make milk after hitting puberty, guys make their own milk all the time. My milk tastes salty. But you can't have any because it's mine. Make your own. Cheapskate! When babies form in the womb, they always start as females. But after 16...